Hey everyone, Tech Steve here, and the TV right here is the Samsung QN90D. This TV has the new AI technology, the new Tizen operating system, and it's packed full of features. So in this video, I'm going to show you the most important features that you need to know to see if it's the right television for you. So sit back and relax, and let's get started. So here we have it. This is the Samsung QN90D. This is a 2024 model and they did do some upgrades over last year models. For example, they did change the processor to the new NQ4 AI second generation processor. The QN90D is a neural QLED 4K television that uses quantum matrix technology. And this offers accurate light control so you can enjoy the details in the darkest and the brightest scenes. And the pixels on this TV are 140 of the size of your traditional LED TV to increase the contrast level significantly. This TV looks just like last year model. On the side of it, you have this really nice thin bezel. And on the bottom, you have this base that makes the TV looks like it's floating in air. On the back of it, you're gonna find some lines on it so you can do some basic wire maintenance. And this TV has plenty of inputs. There's some USB connections, fiber optic output, and four HDMI connections. And this TV will handle up to 144 Hz using HDMI 2.1 and variable refresh rate. The Q90D has a excellent picture quality, especially with this new NQ4 AI generation processor. It makes everything look so much more natural and the contrast ratio is very inky. So you're gonna get the best picture quality out of a TV of this caliber. This Tizen operating system is very snappy going through the different screens on it. And it looks very familiar to last year's version, which was Tizen 7.0. You're going to get features like search where you can use Bixby or Alexa and it has ambient mode. So when you're not using a TV, you can have it to display wall art that you download previously. So you have that nice clean look to match with your decor. There's also a new feature called Daily Plus, and this feature allows you to centralize everything like your SmartThings application. You can get access to your productivity applications such as Microsoft and Google. Plus, there's a built in feature where you can hook up a camera to it so you can use it to do your daily workouts with Samsung's health. It still has the gaming hub and this will give you access to all your different devices. Plus you can hook up a controller to it via Bluetooth and Samsung is building a controller designed just for their television to get the best gaming experience. If you're using cloud gaming, such as your Xbox Ultimate, Luna, GeForce, and a few other ones. Besides the picture performance, this TV has a really snap quickie operating system and together with the SmartThings application, you're gonna get a great experience overall. And I also watched a few movies on this television and it was very smooth and very inky as far as the black levels. And the great thing about this TV is just like the previous models, it has filmmaker mode, along with a few other Samsung built-in picture profiles, including the automatic settings. So you don't even have to worry about trying to adjust the picture. The TV will use the brightness in the room and it will adjust itself completely automatic. The Q90D also has Q-Symphony that fills the room with sound with object trackings. And you can connect a compatible Samsung soundbar working with the TV speakers to immerse yourself in a complete movie experience. If you want to get that slim look on the wall, they do have this slim bracket available as well, sold separately. In my opinion, the 90 series has always been the top of the line for Samsung for the average consumer. This doesn't have the 8K technology. It doesn't have the One Connect box, but it has a great picture. So if you're interested in learning more, I'll leave all the links in the description below. I'm Tech Steve. Thanks all for watching. Catch you on the next one. Peace.